Okay, we are back, and we um, had to change our chocolate pretzel rod um, that we sold at Javachino because, one, the calorie count was too high, as well as the salt content. So, we are able to switch to these, to the little um, pretzel bites, or little braids. And so what we're going to do is we've melted our chocolate, and I'm going to put that in its... I probably should have picked a bottle with a little bit more of an opening, but I might make this work. Okay. All right. So I'm going to just make some Halloween pretzels here. I do. We do have bottles that are, have larger openings that are easier. Okay. All right. So what we're going to do here is we're going to drizzle these with chocolate because we, again, have very strict requirements as to how many calories everything can be with the new nutrition standards. Okay. And since these are for Halloween, whoa. I didn't, there we go. All right, I'm going to sprinkle on um, just some Halloween sprinkles on here. Just for some festive. Again, we can do red and green at Christmas. And, you know, the nice pastels at Easter or, and red and white at Valentine's Day. So we can make them all look very nice. And again, you could use white almond bark and the brown almond bark. You're not limited to the brown. All right, and again, wearing gloves with this is a must. So what we will do is we will put these in the refrigerator to set, all right, and then we will bag them for Halloween. And when we bag them, each bag gets 12 pretzels. Okay, so once they're set, you'll put the 12 pretzels in here, close them, tie them with your curling ribbon, and then they're ready to go for Jabuccino. All right, enjoy.